was doing his usual Wukong thing and being a lazy peach eating idiot. Ignoring all the world's problems. Stop! If you're just here to mess with me, then. Go for it, guy. I don't care anymore. You know, it's no fun when you say it out loud. Nice step, by the way. That's new. Come on, misery kid. I got something to show you. Owen, oh, it's me, Macaque. Or rather, the six-eared Macaque is, you know, my full name. <laughs> uh, what am I looking at right now? On your journey, you'll see that it's the choices you make that determine who you are. I know your latest discovery has thrown you for a loop. Between that and Azure and the Lady Bone Demon trying to get inside your head, uh, you know what? Just play the game. That'll teach you everything you need to know, for once. Besides, I put a lot of work into this. Oh, yeah, no, I can definitely see that. And remind me how this game is supposed to convince me I'm not destined to turn into an evil demon monkey thing again? Because every option I pick takes me to this same screen. Hey, you're finally getting it. No matter what options it's giving you, you're always going to end up in the same spot. Oh, thanks, Macaque. Congrats. You went to more effort than usual to make me feel like dirty dirt dirt. Good job. Round of applause. <sighs> All right, misery kid. You were supposed to realize by now that the choices the game's giving you aren't the only choices you've got. Life isn't some pre-written thing like a video game where you have to do what the tutorial says. Okay, well, kind of a weird convoluted way to make a point, don't you think? Whatever. Point is, it's time to start making your own choices. Something I wish I'd learned a lot sooner than I did. You don't want to fight Azure because people might get hurt. You don't want to not fight him because people might get hurt. So do something else. Only you get to decide who you are, kiddo.